Hi friends, I am starting an experiment to grow cilantro in a lead pot 10 pod hydroponic system. This variety is called Santo and these seeds are from Seeds and Search. The only important thing to start cilantro seeds is we need to make sure we are cracking this uh, shell. There are actually two seeds inside. So we just have to gently roll it, press it and roll it so it will break into two pieces. So this is one important step. This way the cilantro germination rate will be pretty high. So I am going to crack the seeds like this and place these cracked seeds about 2 to 3 in each pod. By the way, sometimes it is very difficult to separate the seeds. In that case, just give a nice crack, even that is also good enough. Just uh, as we are pressing, we can feel that the seed is cracked. So once the seed is cracked well, that is good enough. We don't really need to split the seeds. If we can crack it nicely, that way the moisture can get into the seed and kick off the germination rate a little faster. Okay, this one came off nicely, but sometimes some seeds have a little bit a hard shell, so it is very difficult to completely separate them. Just uh, squeeze between the fingers and give a gentle crack. You will hear a click sound. Then place it. It sounds like a lot of work, but it's absolutely no work at all. That's it. I placed the uh, all 10 pods with uh, two seeds in each pod or like one seed with uh, two gems in each pod. Let's see how this is going to work out. This is my second experiment in this lead pot 10 pod hydroponic system. It's day nine. I see little bit of germination. I see two plants here and one plant here. That's it. I don't see any more germination. Let's wait and see. Looks like uh, some plants are not coming strong. Okay, I thought um, the seedlings are growing above the pod, but looks like they are going deep into the pod, so I don't need to worry much. So I will remove the lid here as well as here, but keep the remaining lids. It's day 10. I see some more germination. Here is one and all these pods just started showing up. We can barely see, yeah, here we can see a nice. So overall this is coming nice. I'm not expecting all 10 pods to show up as seedlings. Even if 8 of them or 7 of them show, that's a great success for me and I can continue the garden with 7 of them. It's day 40. Look at this beautiful cilantro. How beautiful and uh, gigantic these leaves are. Wow. And uh, this cilantro is very flavorful. I just need to pick a little bit and add it to my curries. Much better than the store-bought cilantro for sure in terms of uh, rich flavor. One thing I just wanted to call out is this uh, tip burning. I don't know how to prevent it. I tried so many techniques, but I couldn't prevent this tip burning. But this is just temporary. Let's see. If you can uh, look at this growth very closely, there are a lot of leaves that got burned all around here. But if you look at the center growth, that is coming really nice. So this is always the case. In the beginning of uh, cilantro growth, there will be some tip burns, but somehow the plants recover. No matter what hydroponic system I grow, the plants will recover and uh, uh, the subsequent growth will be really nice, fresh and healthy. I just need to be a little bit patient here. Don't get nervous when I see the tip bones. But after that, the cylinder will come back and it will go at least uh, three to four months. Same thing here. There are tip bones, a uh, few tip bones, but the new growth is coming really nice. And here is another example. The new growth is coming nice here as well. So whenever we see tip burns, we don't need to worry. The plants will come come back. And this is not the first time. This is probably 10th uh, or 15th time I'm seeing uh, this exact pattern. So I never get worried when I see the tip burns. I think that's pretty much about it. From now on, it's uh, very routine. I already started harvesting the leaves. It's been two weeks or at least 10 days I started harvesting the leaves. And uh, it's coming back nice. So I'm going to continue this and uh, 
keep these plants as long as they survive in this garden until the last plant i will keep this garden like this and enjoy uh, enjoy harvesting cilantro all right that is all for now this lead pot is working very well and the cilantro is working very well i just cracked the seeds and dropped and uh, uh, many of the seeds germinated again you can see like some spots don't have any plants one two and three pots so three pots didn't um, have any seeds germinated but the remaining are doing good so always start with all the holes always um, start with all pots and i'm sure like 70 to 80 percent of them will uh, uh, will be successful and the remaining 20 30 i don't really care because i already have full garden of cilantro all right that is all for now thanks for watching and happy hydroponics growing